Hi, in last video we tried texture and uh, I'm going to share things I learned related to camera. In 3D software like Unity, it is very common that we have a camera to control the application screen. We can move the camera to different directions. Move it far away, for example, will make things on original screen look smaller. We can also rotate the camera for sure. In WebGL, there is no such a uh, camera available for us to use, but we can simulate this camera by applying a new transformation matrix to every position. To simulate the effect of moving camera in one direction, we can move all the objects to the opposite direction. The same thing also applies to the rotation. We can rotate all the objects in opposite direction to simulate the effect. So if we can get the transformation matrix for moving the camera, we can simulate this camera by applying the reversed matrix to all the objects. So let's take a look of what I implemented for this video. Uh, this is a camera I simulated, which can move in X, Y, Z. So I read the X, Y, Z from the sliders in rendering loop and made a transformation matrix from them, which is the transformation matrix for camera. After I get this matrix, I inverted it. And let me show you what does this inverted function do. So let me create a X translation matrix and invert it. By calling the invert, we can get the matrix which translate X in opposite direction. After we got the reverted matrix, we can pass this matrix to a text shader. And by applying this matrix to every position, we simulated a camera. That's what I learned about how to simulate a camera in WebGL. Thanks for your watching.